and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on everybody, it's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video guys and today we're going to be going over what you should be doing with your coins right now guys. Now, we're in limbo, as you guys know, that's one of my favorite terms, Madden limbo. That's when I feel like we're in between promos, it's kind of like a dead air. So right now we just finished the Blitz and the Harvest, we're at the end of Season Series 3. So what's coming up is Series 4 and the Christmas promo. Now we're in that weird stretch of the first week or so of the month where there's no promo, there's no new currencies, there's no new series, things are kind of slowing down a little bit. Now lucky for us it's not going to be boring, right? Because we just came off such a blitz and harvest that we never had any downtime, so it's kind of nice to have this little unwinding period. We can relax. Our coins are safe for a little bit. We can relax and all, but in this video, I'm going over the coin stack you guys want for Christmas, why you need that coin stack, and pretty much what I'm doing to build my coin stack and how I'm attacking the market right now. I'll be going over everything, so stay tuned for all that, guys. Now, if you don't remember, this is the 25 Days of Poodmas, as you guys know. You got you guys coined that name, so you guys can you guys can take credit for that. Clap it up for uh, for Poodmas, whoever said that. That was a pretty good one. I don't know, maybe I said that and you guys just liked it. I don't remember, but. It's going every day, every day until the 31st of December or to New Year's Eve, whatever. So all you guys gotta do to enter Poodmas is there will be increasing rewards every single day. I have to say this every video, by the way, guys, because just so people for new viewers, every single day there will be rewards increasingly getting better as we get close to Christmas. So for now, until we start showing some momentum, we'll be at we're at 30k. I announced the other winner in the lineup update video you guys will be seeing. It was Mark Hawkins. If you guys if you haven't heard it already, just DM me on Twitter. Now to enter, all you gotta do is go down below, smash that like button. And comment down below your system and the secret words. At some point in the video, I will be saying secret words. You'll know exactly when I say it. It's going to be a separately cropped portion of the video. So I'll say it. Comment down below. Comment your system so I know what system to give it to you guys on. And all I got to do is like the video to enter. So as the likes and everything go up and all the comments go up, guys, I will be increasing the rewards all the way up until probably gift cards, PSN cards, and Microsoft points cards, which will help you guys open up packs for Christmas. So should be a fun month, guys. Hopefully, we can make this a channel tradition. Now, let's get into this video. So my coin stack's obviously low. I have some things I need to sell. Alright guys, so obviously the coin stack's a little low. My Kittle did just sell though, which is very important because I gotta get the coin stack up. Now, this is for starters, the recommended coin stack for the Christmas promo. I, I gotta say a million coins. Now, can you get in with 500k? Yes. But to make, to really be able to invest properly, I think you need a million. 500k, you can get it done. But 500k, you won't be able to really invest too much. It'll be more about getting the presents, the presents uh, return. Because there's gonna be presents, there's gonna be investments. Now, if they do it just like last year, now, someone was telling me it's not possible that I made 10 million coins during the Christmas promo. I don't have to lie. You guys can go check my first videos on the channel. See how good my team was at that time. I, I bought a team with all those coins. It wasn't really hard. Someone said that it wasn't possible because present with them. I got pretty much one present like every 150k, one decent present. So if I spent 500k, I'd probably pull like three or four of them. Trust me, I, I made a lot, but whatever. Say what you guys want. You'll see this. Cur if it is the same way as last year, guys, we're gonna make tons of coins. Now they might limit the present pull rate this year because it was it was absurd last year. Every you guys know every YouTuber last year had like 10 to 15 of every top present. It was crazy. I don't know if they meant to do that or if it was an accident, but it happened. Now, the reason I recommend a million coins is for two reasons. If I want to replicate what I did last year, I went in last year with about one to two million coins, and I was able to make the 10 mil. Now the way I did it was pretty much I invested in flakes. If they do that again, it might maybe snowman this year. I don't really know. But like I told you guys, I'm the snowflake god. Last year was amazing. And if they do snowflakes again, currency is sometimes the best way to make coins. Now, Halloween currency was not. Halloween currency wasn't the same thing. Because Halloween currency didn't have a blitz. Now, last year with Christmas, they did a blitz. So if they do a Christmas blitz again, pretty much come to the store. You have, you want to stack training for the blitz. Because, oh no, no, you don't want to stack snow. You don't want to actually sell the snow. You want to buy the players that quick sell for snow for the blitz. So what I did pretty much was I bought a bunch of snow players for like 200k. And then when the blitz inevitably came out with snow those snow players went up twice the price and i just resold them back and i made literally 200k per player so i made like a million coins in one shot and i kept doing it but besides the point the point is that you want to get your coin stack up so you can do things like that because when this does start the players the snow players that goes to crowd christmas past and goes to christmas future those cards are gonna cost like two 300k so if you want to see if you only have 500k you can only buy one obviously if you buy it for 250 300k and then you sell it and then you make 400k you're gonna keep gradually progressing but they might only be four or five rounds of blitz so pretty much what i did was i sold in the first round made a million coins second round rebought them back made another million coins if you guys can only afford one per time you might only make like 100k 100k you might only make 400k so if you have a million coins you can buy like three or four of them you can make double 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 and you keep really racking up for every round of the blitz that is why i recommend you have a pretty big coin stack going into this now quick quick advice i wouldn't recommend selling powered up players that's something i don't like doing because powered up players obviously you spend a lot of money on them so like for me I probably wouldn't end up selling many of these cards that I do have here, although I definitely want to. 
I wouldn't rec really recommend it because you're going to be losing a lot of coins and training in the process. Now, should you guys be stacking up on training? I mean, you, it's always good to get training. Training is at an all-time low right now. It's like I think it's like 13k. Per, I mean, 13 coins per. Secret word for this video is Snow Angel, guys. I'm gonna have to start thinking of new words. So I'm running out already. I'm gonna have to start repeating some. But comment it down below and your system to enter and make sure to like the video. So you can you can always stack up, but I think the Christmas promo might just make it worse. So when it first drops, it'll probably be cheaper, and then you want to stack up on stuff. When, when it first drops, flakes and training should be cheap because there's gonna be no use for them. Then as we get towards like a blitz and stuff, it might get really really expensive. So that's why it's good to always stack up on it. Now, training is obviously pretty cheap, as you guys can see here. Definitely not expensive at all. What I would personally do, though, is, like I said, you need the coin. I think coins are first and foremost what you need. Because I don't, I wouldn't stack up on training just yet, more than likely, actually. Because I want the coins. I think the coins are the best route to go. Because when the promo drops and everything starts crashing, you can take advantage. You can get the card you need. And then, I'll make a video that time going over what to stack up on. But for the time being... You obviously can't stack up on snowflakes because it's not that time yet. Now, when this promo does first drop, there's going to be a lot of things coming out. My best advice for your coins, guys, don't buy anything. Do not buy anything the first day. The first day, people oversell everything because people are like, they, they just pulled them. They're excited. So I wouldn't recommend anything. The first day, you're going to come over to 94 95 All the cards are going to be there. And you're going to be like, everything's going to be crazy priced. Give it some time. Things will start coming down a little bit. Now, the only way it won't be crazy price is if they drop some massive bundles initially that people are buying left and right. It all depends, right? Now, a lot of these cards are already cheap, which is why I really don't recommend just selling players off. NFL 100 players, you probably could get a decent return on. Those are probably the only cards right now you can get a decent return on for the money you probably spent on them. Now, going over what I would do to attack this promo, would I be investing in some power-ups? There's some powers could be investing, guys. I, I truthfully think Pat Mahomes would be getting a card. He has to. I, th I, think, for, I think it's almost 100% Pat Mahomes would be getting a Christmas card. So... If we go check out his power up, I think it has to be going for a decent amount. I think that I, I sold my Pat Mahomes for 20k just because I need I was I needed a coin. I was feeling really desperate without coins. I had like 1k coins after I bought some cards. But I actually maybe it didn't sell. I know I put it up. He's going for like 18k. If you could snipe some of these for like 15k, if he gets a new card that can get like um what's it called? Like roaming dead eye or dashing dead eye, he will go up to like a 40k power up. So if you can get some for 15k, maybe scoop just a few. If you have some ready, good, keep them. He has to get a card. I know for a fact he didn't get a Halloween card. A thing he hasn't gotten a single card in any promo this year superstars wasn't really a promo that was a quick little hitter since any of the big promos he's not gotten one card he will be getting one i can account for that like literally pat mahomes has to get one so make sure you get his power if you get some if you get him for cheap enough don't you know don't break the bank for him but that's a decent one to go for now the christmas promo is going to introduce a lot of presents which is why you need the coins presents are going to be one of the most fun it's one of the most fun things every year so just in, in screw coin making for a second you want to invest in presents because that's going to be fun. It's going to be a fun time, man. And last year, the presents were extremely profitable. So you definitely want to have the coins for those. Presents, the way they're going to work, guys, you're going to come over to, you're going to come over to the store. You're going to go over to where it says, like, Blitz Bolt, bolt Packs. It'll be, like, Snow snow Packs, and it's going to say right there, Presents. If they do the same way as last year, obviously. I don't know how they're going to change it. But for the time being, all I know is that the Christmas promo is always, you need coins. Because coins will get you presents, snowflakes, everything. That's been, the, that's always been the thing. Christmas has been unique coins. And then around Christmas Day, there'll be some cool bundles. You can open some bundles if you like to. I'm not the biggest bundle spender. I do have a bundle ready for you guys, though, that I will be opening around Christmas. So stay tuned for that. Now, I think that wraps up the majority of the coin tips I had for you guys. Let's, let's, let's wrap it up to make sure I didn't miss anything. We got the investments. It's just like, I think Mahomes is just a solid investment. I really do think he is. I think that a million coin stack is what you're going to need. Now, 500k, I said, is doable, but I prefer a million in terms of in terms of presents too, you guys have to understand, it's like you go to the store, right? You buy a lotto ticket. You buy one lotto ticket, you lose a dollar. You don't make it. You buy a lotto ticket, you lose a dollar. You buy 10 lotto tickets, you probably at least win one. You might not make your money back, but you'll win one. So the thing with presents is that you got to open a lot because you can open 200K worth of presents and get nothing, but that $201 present, you know, that one's a big banger that makes all your money back. So you always got to spend enough. You got to, you got to, you know, money makes money. So last year I had a million coins, so I opened up a million worth of presents. I pulled a few Ed Reeds. Each Ed Reed, I, I would know. I knew that if that was Ed Reed or whatever, if it was a top Ravens card, it would go for at least 500k. So I was like, okay, I think I made my money back. Let's go again. Then I pulled another four. I'm like, okay, now I doubled my coins. I kept, I just kept going. Now that's kind of how, like, you know, that's kind of how probability works. If you open up 100, you're supposed to get at least three, you know, something like that. So I just recommend you guys have the coins for that. It's gonna be a really, really fun time. I'm gonna have every video for you guys. So don't, don't, don't do anything about that. You know, don't worry. And as far as coin making this week. What I'm pretty much doing, I'm playing Seasons and Weekend League. This is my one week off with no crazy content. I'm going to be playing a ton of Seasons, a ton of Weekend League. I got to get my coins up, and I got to get my Weekend League games one up because I need I need those coins. I need coins and I need trophies. Your Series 4 is also coming, guys. So you want to get your trophies used up as quickly as possible. I'm going to probably try to get to 1,000. I need to play Seasons. Seasons get you like 3K per game. 
4k depending on your division so i'm trying to get coins from there i'm trying to get some weekend league coins i'm trying to build up my coin stack as much as possible this week because i can knock on christmas broke in worst case scenario i gotta buy packs I'm, i might have to i might have to do that or pick up some coins from a sponsor such as myself i don't really want to throw a self-promotion there but it, it, it seems it seems fit okay guys so that is about it for the video i hope you guys did enjoy if you're into the channel hit that subscribe button turn that oni bell boys come join the family let's see if we can get to 17k by the end of christmas that is the goal even 16k will make me happy we're, we're getting there boys we're doing it comment down below your system and the secret word that you heard throughout this video at any time that i ended up putting it and don't forget to smash the like button all you gotta do is like and comment down below to enter for 25 days of food miss really 31 days 25 days so but i like the name so we're sticking with it that is about it guys thank you so much for watching i'm out see you guys next video peace